Here are your possible $2 daily double payoffs, coupling the first race winner, number five, too cheap to buy, with the horses in the second, number one, TJ's Wolf, and Tom Bussey, $137 even. Number two, first and gold, Mark Saparito, $163.20. Number three, closing pass, Larry Ward, $524.40. Number four, Belvedere Buck and Dan Knox, $391.60. Number five, King Ghetto, Dave McGee, $46.20. Number six, Final Dynasty, Gary Leonard, $312.60. Number seven, Orbisong, Randy Jacobs, $198.20. Number eight, Fox Valley Boomer, Jim Curran, $66.60. Now three minutes to post, just three minutes. It is rolling top of the turn. Here they come. I'm off. Closing pass between horses. There goes TJ's Wolf, Belvedere Buck, and four wide. Fox Valley Boomer into the turn, and TJ's Wolf benefits from the inside, but closing pass, pressing the pace and whipping on the outside as they curve into the black stretch, heading for the opening quarter. And closing pass is your leader, and off stride up the back stretch is TJ's Wolf. Now they drive by the quarter, and closing pass has the lead for 30 feet because here comes Fox Valley Boomer charging 29 and 2 the quarter. Fox Valley Boomer with a rush, no taking command. It's closing pass second, it's TJ's Wolf. Third on the outside, here comes first and gold. Followed by Belvedere Buck, King Ghetto. Followed on the inside of us is Arbisong, Final Dynasty. Heading for the half, but it's all Fox Valley Boomer. And Fox Valley Boomer opens up the lead. It's closing pass under the whip in second. Halfway home, 59 seconds flat. Fox Valley Boomer leans into the clubhouse turn. Closing pass is second. Two lengths followed by first and gold. On the inside, TJ's Wolf and King Ghetto. Out of the turn, they curve into the box direction. Fox Valley Boomer has a three-length lead. King Ghetto is on the chase in second. Closing pass followed now by TJ's Wolf with never to go. Orba Song driving by three quarters. Three quarters, 129 flat. Here comes King Ghetto. And King Ghetto charging up now to take command. It's Fox Valley Boomer back to second. It's a gap to first and gold closing pass. Here they coming down the stretch. King Ghetto has the lead. Fox Valley Boomer is trying to come back, but through the stretch, it's King Ghetto opening up the lead now with every stride. It's King Ghetto all alone at the wire. Fox Valley Boomer is second. TJ's Wolf up for third. Number five, King Ghetto was first. Number eight, Fox Valley Boomers second. Number one, TJ's Wolf third. Number two, first and gold was four. Ladies and gentlemen, the inquiry sign is posted. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a Stewart's inquiry. And this inquiry concerns the unofficial third finisher. Number one, TJ's Wolf for a possible violation of the breaking rule approaching the first quarter. Please hold all tickets. Let's check in at Belmoral. We are seven minutes away from tonight's the third disqualification. In this race, number one, TJ's Wolf finished third but has been disqualified by the Stewarts and placed fourth for a violation of the breaking rule, interfering with number two, first and gold, while on a break, moving to the quarter. That moves number two, first and goal to third, placing number one, TJ's Wolf four. Results of Maywood's second, our official marked the mile 159 and a fifth. 